give me here. Ah, there we go. All right, so this is uh, my review of the Kidcraft Majestic Mansion. This is a dollhouse. And when I say that, I feel absurd because this uh, dollhouse, this uh, uh, you know, thing for toys, comes up to my chest. <laughs> Look at this. Look how big this is. Um, I didn't buy this. This was a gift from a relative who uh, didn't get good information about just how big it was. Uh, she told me that when she was ordering it, it had you know, a little girl next to it and it seemed normally sized. <laughs> I believe her. Um, but when we got this, it took me about three and a half hours to assemble. Uh, Kidcraft really does a poor job with their instructions. There's no words. Um, it's just black and white lines. And there are a lot of parts on here where you really want the colors and everything to match up. But they give you no hints in the instructions about which goes where, so you have to figure it out on your own. And I had to assemble and disassemble and reassemble a few times to get it right because they gave me no useful hints I had to figure out the hard way. Um, it's okay building materials. It's got some real wood, but it's all mostly just this glorified cardboard holding it up together. Um, it looks impressive. Uh, you should see my daughter's face when she came home from, uh, from a relative's house. Um, I assembled this while she was gone, and she came home to, to see this just parked right here, and she was stunned. And so was the relative who gave us this. She came in here and and saw this and was totally astounded. <laughs> she was completely bewildered to she had no idea it was this big. So now we have this uh, lovely piece of furniture. I mean, it is everything a little girl could want from a dollhouse times 10. Uh, it has, it's a four story dollhouse. It has a grand staircase. It has an elevator between the second and third floors. It has a furnished attic with a nursery for the baby. It has a piano. It has a bathroom. It has a patio. It has a garage. Cars are in there right now, but yeah, that's where they keep the cars. It's incredible. It is beyond what I could ever possibly dreamed for a, uh, a dollhouse. And in that regard, it's great. I mean, it really is fancy, but it is a real challenge to put together. So if you're going to get one of these for your children, make sure you, you have an afternoon set aside to assemble it. It is really challenging. And then also, they have different colors painted on a lot of the bolts that hold together to match paint in different spots. But they don't give you any information about which ones go where. You have to figure out on your own. So I'm not even sure I did, I did it right, so I'm not even that good at telling you which ones go where. Just try and pay attention to which uh, bolts are painted what color and try and match them up to where they go. Um, but odds are you're going to mess it up anyway. Good luck.